Yo, what's up? Well, one thing's for sure, we got some good stuff going. Good stuff is going on. We just took down Jin's Wonder, and of course, the farms are making a guest appearance once again. And getting all up in my grill, saying to me, Okay, you gotta rebuild me. Anyways, let's go through what I did while you guys were gone, as I said earlier. What I did, pretty simple stuff. I built a mining camp there to get the amount of gold uh, in this little enclosed area because once you get outside of the Great Wall, Sisia or Hisiaza will come uh, just blowing in, blowing in at you. Same with, same with the tan guts and that's the song down there, the pitiful song. And uh, as you can see on the map, I really did some uh, good scouting with a couple of my hussars. Good old hussars. I, you guys probably, I mean, you, you know, I hate hussars. So, I mean, it was quite surprising I actually used it. Got some good old technologies. Everything is set. Um, built all these buildings. Not going to be dealing with these units, so I don't really need to use that. Got my champions ready. Got these guys ready to go. So, oh yes, this castle has been a behemoth. Yes, a behemoth. Not not a leviathan, not a, uh, a beast, a behemoth. And it's taken down many units. You've seen the remnants of about a couple of them there. Um, and it's just eroding Jin's economy. If you want to build a castle right here and you can draw a bunch of units in, that will deprive them from building any other units because they'll waste and, uh, all their gold. This also will just draw Hisia Hisia for a while. Anyways, I have an armada of 30 ships. You're going to have to clear out uh, some of your uh, population to get these ships in. Maybe, you know, sacrifice a little villager here and there. Yeah, I'm a cannibal. Might as well. Um, ten cannon galleons, elite cannon galleons, fast fire ships, ten of those, and ten galleons. So, with this armada, shut up. Alright, I'm just going to queue up some farms. Don't want to be doing this during the assault. We're going to take Jin down. The reason I go for Jin first is because once you take them off the map, you have a whole, um, a whole map to a whole side of the map to get resources from to draw resources from so we're gonna go with them first um, it's good to keep your cannon galleons ready uh, but not too close because they can get a little vulnerable and uh, but primarily use these guys so we're gonna put them down here any units that come by will be burnt to a crisp song don't give a crap about you you're so pitiful that I already lose a unit Oh, I'm losing some villagers. Well, I'm screwing that. I'm taking Jin down right here, so we're gonna go for Jin first. No, not the alcohol. Don't get. No, we're not getting confused with the alcohol, people. That's not. That's the yellow Chinese. No, okay. I'm getting a little crazy right now. Okay, so as you can tell, we have some keeps right on the borders. They're gonna be uh, just dominated by me. Like usual, I'm Genghis Khan, so I dominate. If one thing you know about me, I dominate, so you probably have known that ever since uh, I started making walkthroughs. I mean, you see my first video, <laughs> dominates. Actually, it's total opposite, but I like to uh, pro sell. Uh, self proclamation's a good thing, but once again, I need my ego to be filled and fed constantly. So, we're just going to go for the keeps, and as I said, they have a good two dozen keeps. Overkill, ridiculous, but perfect for Jin because they are kind of ridiculous and um, use American voiceovers. Oh, frick you. You're going down. You're going down. You don't mess with the Mongols. You mess with the Mongooses, not the Mongols. I don't know about what you're thinking. So you got to do a little micromanaging. It's never hurt anybody. Oh, freaking monks. How can you be converting anything? Loser! Loser! No one makes monks. No one wants to be monk because you stay in a building your whole life. So get off me. Go. Could be a loser. Loser! Just making my felt self feel good, I guess, because monks use them quite a bit. Alright. Well, they got some Chuko New too. That's pretty pathetic. What kind of name is Chuko New? I mean, it says three names right in there. You got a first, middle, and last all together. That's convenient. Too bad everybody has the same name. That's kind of confusing, though. 
Alright, now get the frick off me. I've had enough of you, Chuko new. So, well, that's awfully close. I'm not going to be doing that. Um, doing the, during this assault, you can simultaneously be producing more units, but, um... Actually, yeah, I'm going to do that. Um, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. I want to produce units, not have to dink around. Alright. Cannon galleons, here we go. Go for this keep. Let's try this again. Hopefully monks won't be getting in our way, and then you can go for the dock. Uh, always go for the source. Always go for the source first. Now, where are the cannonballs coming from here? I don't see no cannonballs lately. Cannibals? Uh, yes, we're going back to the cannibals, because I am a cannibal. But I don't have cannabis. Alright, you're done. Uh, let's go for the dock. Or should we go for the castle? You know what? I'm going to go for the castle just because... I want to see a behemoth fall. Because, you know what? I'm just going to call them behemoths from now on. No! No! Keep... Don't you realize? I have some... Some guys... We got a lot of brawn here. We got a lot of brawn. Elite cannon galleons, for sure. Pack a, lot, pack a lot of punch. Very little brains. It's essential in Age of Empires. And you're probably going to die because you're getting too close there. So, as you can tell, they are deprived from resources. So, we can easily take down anything in our way. Because they have no navy. But surprisingly, you're going to get quite a bit of resistance from um, good old monks. Good old monks. And I will be using monks quite a bit in the fifth mission. Um, I just played that mission again today. I'd rock that stuff. I mean, King Wenceslas' soul was just strewn all across Bohemia. I mean, it just felt bad for him. I mean, he couldn't feed any wandering boys because I was just there to, to not annihilate him, essentially. Or dominate, because, you know, I, I dominate. Very good. Very hardcore. So just keep moving on here with your elite cannon galleons. You might want to bring some fast fire ships in to protect your volley of ballistics. Uh, because there's another dock down there and you don't want to be met with a a navy that you can't take down with the cannon galleons. Because if you haven't gotten used to using cannon galleons, they suck at close range. I mean, just, they're telling you, I mean, like, too close to attack. I mean, sorry, man. I made this game to just annoy you and to put huge red warning signs at the bottom of the screen. I mean, I was playing it earlier today. It said, I, I swear each time, like, my mind was playing tricks on me. It was like, it is way too far to attack. It wasn't just like they were saying, this structure is too far away to attack. It, each time I glanced down there, I was like, I, I knew a way was like inserted in there. But, I mean, obviously it wasn't. Because that would just be unnecessary. But quite hysterical. So, if it is hysterical, it makes it necessary, I guess. If you get my drift. So, I'm taking down this monastery first because good old monasteries. I know, I like the design there, but they produce yunks. Yunks. <laughs> uh, good old yunks. Man, I just struggling. Once I ever, ever went, ever since I went to play a, a game filled with different cultures, I have been struggling to speak my own language, which is no coincidence whatsoever. So we're just gonna keep moving on here, and I believe they have four more keeps, which is just bamboozling me. I mean, bamboozling. Nothing usually bamboozles me. I mean, bewilders me. Maybe not. No, not bamboozles. Oh, eight keeps. Where'd you get all this stone from? I mean, you got that cannabis, but you know I'm. S eh, they're stoners. Well, they, oh, they have opium. That's right, opium here. The op good old opium wars, and I'm just saying good old like everything is good old, and it isn't. So we're gonna go for the second castle, the second behemoth. Excuse me of gin and do they have hoardings apparently they don't have hoardings which is unfortunate how can you not have the number 6389 don't tell me how clean cut that number is because that is the most random number i've heard in a long time and too bad we don't have music anymore because that music has just been I, it could put me to sleep to say the least so once again we have a stone enforced building burning to a crisp 
And good thing we have Super Mario to you know you know what is terrible? The the most logical game I'm playing right now is Halo. Yeah, I I bet you never would think I would ever say that in my life, but I am. Uh so let, let's not let's just try to get a little lot more logical. I don't even know what the most logical game I have is. And you would think it'd be Age of Empires, probably the most informative, uh, but the most logical game uh is a sports game probably and that you know but it's just pathetic how illogical super mario is as well i mean even pokemon you can just you can you can point fingers at th certain things constantly all day long just do it making fun of it making fun of video games is half the entertainment of video games themselves if you don't know how to make fun of video games you have no life essentially i mean playing video games as your life is obviously no life, but um, not, make, not making fun of them really puts you over the edge and puts you in the upper echelon of gamers. Uh, so, gotta learn how to do that. I mean, 101, man. I gotta make my video game 101 video. I mean, let's see how that would go. And I am just sick here. 26,000 points? <laughs> I'm boss! Awesome sauce once again. Two videos in a row, and that is it for their keeps. Other than these things, which I probably don't have enough range to hit, unfortunately. And Sung thinks they're all that. It's doing crap over there. And I'm gonna queue up some more farms because I have a feeling I'm gonna lose farms. Other thing I did, I used Sung or the engineer's force. Use that as wood. That's a good place to get wood. But we'll be going over here for wood later once I take down all of Jin, which is. Uh, not gonna happen anytime soon, or not not anytime soon, but not till next video. And I'm not gonna do a little cut here until I get more units ready, because in between now and the next video, I'll be building up that uh, force that I need to actually go into Jin's bay, actual base, and take him down. Other than just outskirts crap. Um, and once I do take Jin's base down, I'm gonna go up the river, and you can actually attack sung and a little bit his yes 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 yeah and uh definitely the tang guts from this river and just annihilate them so i'll be doing that it's a little bit difficult because c c uh, has some uh good siege units that will make it difficult for you but we're not gonna have, i'm not gonna want to do that but too late i can't trade with the market yes it's still alive thank you elite candy galleons for sucking because i might want to be trading with that once i lose a certain amount of gold uh but they have plenty of gold in this mission. One there. One there. Alright. Let's see. Let's take down the siege workshop. How much time we have? Two minutes left. So, in two minutes, I can take down some of these structures. Installments. And just probably do some more scouting out. See what they have left. They really don't have much left and I'm sure they don't have any units left because they're not sending any more units towards me. And they're really dropping low on uh, production. So they're going to be easy to take down once I get the chance to. Once I take down their town center. Which should be pretty soon. Pretty soon here. Looks like I can't take anything else out. So I'm going to send cannon galleons over here. I'm going to get them repaired really quick. Don't want to be going into this little river area and just getting blown to bits by some good old stone ballistics. And I really don't know what other ballistics they have right now other than heads? Are they throwing body parts? Uh, maybe? Doubt it. But they're cannibals. So, wow, that was a long way for you guys to run. Losers. <laughs> you and monks. Losers. You know better. <laughs> okay. Oh, all right, yeah, you're smart, Alec. Going for the scout cavalry, helping me out a lot. <laughs> Thank you, Galleons, for uh, wasting your time and my time. And that is a lot of blood and a lot of horses on the ground. So, not really much else to do in this video. So I'm going to repair these Ganon Galleons, go down the river next time, and we'll take down Jin once I get the forces ready. So I'll see you guys later in part, part 8. We're going along quickly. So this is going to be, what is this? What is this right now? Part 4 of Into China? Hopefully we can beat Lord of Arabia. That took way too long. And uh, we should be doing that. So I'll see you guys later.